Good morning folks. This is Glenn again, aka Raymond X. And today is going to be the Word for Today Part 3. The Word for Today Part 3, and this is the Day of Mecca. This is found in Prophecy number 44. That's http colon slash slash prophecy dot org slash zero zero four four pro dot htm. That's Prophecy 44. Website is http colon slash slash prophecy.org slash 0044pro.htm This is going to be found in the book of Isaiah the, the book of Isaiah chapter 13 verses 1 through 18 Isaiah 13 verses 1 through 18 The burden of Babylon which Isaiah the son of Amoz did see Lift ye up a banner unto the high mountain exalt the voice unto them, shake the hand, that they may go into the gates of the nobles. I have commanded my sanctified ones. I have also called my mighty ones for mine anger, even them that rejoice in my highness. The noise of a multitude in the mountains, like as of a great people. A tumultuous, tumultuous noise of the kingdom of nations gathered together. The Lord of hosts mustered the host of the battle. They come from a far country, from the end of heaven. Even the Lord and the weapons of his indignation to destroy the whole land. How ye, for the day of the Lord is at hand. It shall come as a destruction from the Almighty. Therefore shall all hands be faint, and every man's heart shall melt. And they shall be afraid. Pangs and sorrow shall take hold of them. They shall be in pain. As a woman that travaileth, they shall be amazed one at another. Their faces shall be as flames. Behold, the day of the Lord cometh, cruel both with wrath and fierce anger, to lay the land desolate, and he shall destroy the sinners thereof out of it. For the stars of heaven and the constellations thereof shall not give their light. The sun, the sun shall be darkened in his going forth. And the moon shall not cause her light to shine. And I will punish the world for their evil and the wicked for their iniquity. And I will cause the arrogancy of the proud to cease, and will lay low the haughtiness of the terrible. I will make a man more precious than fine gold, even a man than the golden wedge of Ophir. Therefore, I will shake the heavens, and the earth shall remove out of her place. In the wrath of the Lord of hosts, and in the day of his fierce anger. And it shall be as the chaste roe, and as a sheep that no man taketh up. They shall every man turn to his own people, and flee every one into his own land. Every one that is found shall be thrust through, and every one that is joined unto them shall fall by the sword. Their children also shall be dashed to pieces before their eyes. Their houses shall be spoiled, and their wives ravished. Behold, I will stir up the Medes, the Medes against them, which shall not regard silver, which shall not regard silver, and as for gold, 
they shall not delight in it. Their bows also shall dash the young men to pieces, and they shall have no pity on the fruit of the womb. Their eye shall not spare children. This is in Isaiah chapter 13, verses 1 through 18. Thank you everyone for your time. Have a great day. Be blessed. And I thank you very much for your time. God bless you all. God loves you. And I love you. Jesus is coming soon. Get ready. Bye bye for now.